Dr. Deepak Sahu, an old friend, stalwarts of the industry, uh, all trade partners, you are all welcome. It's, it's a real pleasure to be here in uh, Calcutta after a very long time and presenting about uh, something which, which is so visible about the IT, you know. We are the displays, you know. So whatever you're seeing over here is, is actually a display and we're doing all those things with a lot of aplomb. And so I'd just like to take you through what ViewSonic is all about. Uh, we, we, are, we are basically a 35-year-old company. Uh, we're kind of veterans in the IT industry, uh, as far as IT is concerned. We've been doing displays since 1987. We started off our operations from US, where we are headquartered. And today, we are 1,200 employees globally present in 100 countries. Uh, our vision has been to basically see the difference, our brand promise, you know. So whatever we do, we do it with so much of uh, passion about displays, uh, creating niches uh, when it comes to end users, uh, the kind of uh, industries, the kind of customers, uh, from content creators to uh, plain, simple operators, we have displays for all of them. Uh, in this world uh, where uh, COVID has brought upon uh, so much of uh, uh, tragedy, where uh, education had to be shifted immediately, you know, from uh, from the uh, from the classroom to the online mode, we had the interactive panels and uh, our cloud-based software, which is called MyViewBoard, uh, which during the COVID period uh, saw almost like four million downloads. You know, so as I'll uh, take you through this presentation, I'll show you how it has impacted the world. You know, so our core values have been, of course, customer focus. So uh, we have been working on technologies at a very anticipatory mode, you know. So uh, when it comes to monitors, which we started off with, uh, we started creating different fields. We were the first company to go LED, you know, uh, somewhere around 2011, when uh, most of the uh, displays were LCD-based, which had CCFL backlights. So when it came to uh, transforming to energy efficiency or uh, creating a much better product, uh, it was uh, ViewSonic at the fore, you know. And of course, uh, we've, we have a growth mindset, which obviously uh, takes through new technologies, uh, teamwork and agility, uh, a word which has been used over here. And we do it with a lot of integrity and uh, corporate citizenship. This year, uh, as I said, is our 35th anniversary. And it's, it's, it's been a long journey, you know, starting off from a display manufacturer to uh, reaching a point where we were uh, leaders and then uh, transforming ourselves into more of a B2B company uh, where uh, we started uh, doing a lot of uh, products and solutions for the, for the, for the uh, uh, enterprises. As you can see, uh, we've had uh, leadership positions. Uh, we've, uh, we've been uh, at the forefront of uh, innovation uh, in terms of a lot of products that we see today, which are so, uh, so common all around us. And uh, the latest uh, I would like to take you, uh, without uh, going through a long list, has been the MyViewBoard, which is the classroom software and the interactive panels, where we happen to be the number one brand in the world today. Uh, we do this through a lot of partnerships uh, when it comes to technology. Uh, as you can see on the left side, uh, we have all the big names uh, in the industry from hardware to software and the ecosystem creators, uh, the be very best of the distributors uh, in India and abroad. Uh, in terms of resellers, uh, we have uh, not only uh, some of the uh, very, uh, you know, the, the, the local uh, level uh, resellers we have, we have resellers who have uh, national footprints these days. And those are listed over here. Of course, our consumers and uh, uh, pro-AV partners. In India, uh, we renewed our monitor business starting 2021. And uh, we became the fastest growing monitor brand in 2021. Uh, we were the first in the industry to offer extended warranties to a normal customer who uh, comes and buys a product. Uh, the usual warranty is three years. We started off and we started giving an additional two years warranty. And uh, we brought all our small partners, who are the last mile partners, who are uh, connected to the customers through a cloud-based app. And 
you know, uh, all our interactions, all our communication is pushed through this app. So this has been a kind of, uh, you know, revolutionizing, uh, I think in, in the days, weeks and months to, uh, you know, uh, in, in the weeks uh, that will happen, it will become uh, a very common thing amongst the industry. So we've been the first uh, kind of, uh, you know, uh, in this to connect with all the trade partners. And though we are uh, not at a leading position, but that's what our endeavor is. We want to be amongst the top three by 2023. So that's been our focus, you know. Education, just a minute. So, so we, we've created now our displays uh, around the end uses of uh, those displays. So when it comes to education, we have interactive panels, we have projectors, where again, uh, when it comes to energy efficient uh, products, we are global number one. We are number one in LED projectors, we are number one in interactive flat panels. Uh, in terms of corporate, uh, in the last two years, we've seen a lot of transformation. We brought products which have helped in the hybrid workplaces. So as we, as we go through, we'll, we'll see all those products in a brief. And of course, when it comes to consumer uh, market, uh, we have a lot of offerings uh, from gaming to, uh, uh, what do you call, uh, you know, uh, interactive to portable touch monitors. So we have been straddling across the spectrum, but very, very clear focus towards the end use of those displays. As you can see, uh, our main product lines are pen displays, uh, the monitors, uh, all those products are outside, so I would invite you uh, after this session is over to come and have a look at those products and we'll explain to you how uh, transformative those products are, some of them, you know. Uh, the third one is, of course, the view board and the commercial displays, the direct view LED displays, and the projectors. So five product lines, five very distinct product lines, uh, from five inches to 300 inches of displays. In terms of monitors, you know, uh, earlier monitors used to be very generic products. Uh, you know, you bought a PC and then you had an afterthought that, okay, now I'd uh, like to go and buy a monitor. But since IT has gone into every aspect of our life, from content creation to gaming to just simple use of office, video conferencing, monitors are being built for every single use. And uh, you'll be surprised to know, uh, we are having almost 50 different types of monitors today, and they're all available in the country. So based on your primary use, we have a monitor for you. Uh, starting off from uh, normal 18.5 inch, the normal box monitor, you know, to 38 inch monitors, which are color professional, color accurate, and bring in a lot of features which are used by content creators. So we have touch, we have the workspace collection, the professional series, and the gaming. And, and over here, a very important aspect is the touch series. So touch monitors are finding increasing use in podiums. Uh, you know, maybe this kind of a presentation that I'm giving over here would have been through a podium where our uh, touch monitors have been used. They're being used in factory automation. Uh, with the, the automation that is happening right now in factories, lines, uh, production lines becoming very, very lean, fewer people, uh, intervention if it is required, those monitors are being used to stop, uh, analyze, move the uh, assembly lines. So again, we have a leadership in this. Uh, it comes to a lot of companies who are buying our touch monitors for those end use applications. In workspace, we have monitors which are being used in uh, offices, in large seating offices. They increase your productivity. So a normal 14-inch laptop today you use may not be sufficient to give you the space or the real space, real estate that you're seeing on a, on a display. You need a large ultra-wide monitor, so we have an ultra-wide monitor. So that's one part of it. And of course, gaming. In this pandemic period, a lot of people shifted their office work, their, uh, their, uh, you know, their personal use to homes, and that's where we saw that uh, gaming monitors started uh, coming in. Not only were they increasing the productivity of people working out of homes, but they were also ad adding to the entertainment part. So in the workspace solution, we have 
the USB-C docking monitors. So uh, USB-C docking monitors are kind of revolutionizing. They have just started taking off. Uh, we must have heard recently that uh, the European Union uh, would be very soon standardizing on the connectors that are used for any kind of IT product and they're zeroing on uh, USB-C. So a monitor with a USB-C is something so simple to connect, just one cable which can actually allow data, your uh, image, as well as the net to flow through one single cable and minimizing the workspace, adding up to the productivity of people. Okay. And then of course, a uh, lot of people need to collaborate and again, during this pandemic, uh, we saw that people were collaborating remotely, sitting out of their homes. That's where the webcam monitors came in. And we've got a fantastic line of webcam monitors which really uh, make the whole session so personal and so uh, enriching, you know. As I said, uh, the ultra-wide monitors. So instead of having multiple monitors, in many of the user scenarios, you have just one monitor and you have a lot of real estate. You have multiple windows on one single monitor. Portable displays, uh, again, so if you have to give a presentation to somebody, you can be carrying a portable monitor along with you. Uh, you can just place it across and you can draw power from your laptop and you can be giving a presentation to somebody one-on-one. -on -one. Or even for that matter, you want another display along with your laptop computer and you can just place it next to you and you have two screens. And all this in just about 700 grams, okay? You just fold it and just keep it in your bag along with the laptop. So this is one, uh, one uh, monitor category which is coming up. Uh, India is uh, exploding with a lot of content creation. A lot of web designing is happening. A uh, lot of designing for uh, uh, animation is happening in the country. A lot of textile designing is happening. And what used to be earlier very expensive uh, solutions for displays has been made much, much affordable now with our Color Pro series of monitors. These are the real accurate monitors uh, which give you a certain, uh, a certain uh, uh, you know, accuracy. A minimum uh, level of uh, distortion is there uh, between what you see on the screen and what is the output when it comes out uh, at the print stage or wherever it is to be used. So these are those monitors, Color Pro monitors, where we have uh, technology alliance with, uh, with a company called Pentone, uh, which is the color standard of the uh, industry. And of course, uh, there are other uh, standards like Adobe and all. So we have range of monitors which cater to all these. And there is a huge, huge uh, market. We see diverse uses coming in from textile uh, designers to people who are into uh, doing uh, animation, back-end work for Hollywood. So, so these monitors are basically catering to those segments. Gaming, as I said, uh, had uh, uh, come up. So not only individual gamers, in fact, gaming monitors have found various uses, uh, even in your normal uh, uh, delivery of education, your uh, video content which is being played. It is much more smoother when you're using a monitor uh, which is a gaming monitor with very high refresh rates and adaptive sync technologies inbuilt. Uh, this, this pen display thing is a new thing, okay? Uh, it's coming up. Uh, it has had some forms of uh, usages till now. Some of the uh, people in animation or some people who are doing digital signatures have been using them. But recently we found a very, very different use, you know. So when... Uh, the judicial uh, system was down when uh, the whole uh, court system was going online. At that time, we see, and now it's a, it's a, it's a project which has been undertaken where the entire uh, cases, instead of being on paper files, will be digitized and probably a judge would be having just a display and he would be writing all his notes on it. So any judgment, any signatures, nothing coming in the physical form. And that's where ViewSonic plays a leading role. We are uh, a leading manufacturer of pen displays, uh, not only for our brand, but for uh, other brands as well in the US and Europe. Uh, in India, we have launched these products and uh, we are doing a lot of pilots with a lot of government agencies, people who are uh, delivering uh, services. So all this thing is happening, banking industry, all security, all with full security, all these devices are being used. So these are new things which are coming up. 
projectors, uh, which we have normally been seeing. Uh, so we have invested, uh, as I said earlier also, we were the first in the world to completely make our monitor lineup LED backlit, you know. And uh, in, the, in, in the projectors also, we were the first to latch on to the LED uh, li lighting instead of the lamp-based projectors, which were consuming a lot of energy. Today, we are number one in the LED projectors market in the world. Uh, the interactive displays, they have played a huge, huge role in education and will continue to do so. So instead of a normal blackboard, we see situations where uh, now the interactive displays, people are writing on them, the content is being created, it's being, it's being converted into uh, text, and of course being recorded. ViewSonic has invested in this since the year 2013, and when this pandemic came, we were ready with a solution like no other. So with, along with my view board, uh, you know, the software that goes along with this, uh, it makes it very, very simple to use. Uh, we have taken up a leadership uh, in this category across not only in India, but worldwide. So this, this is a huge uh, uh, ecosystem, which is uh, where we partner with a lot of uh, uh, service providers, the hardware makers and all. And uh, we create this uh, very simple to use, very intuitive software. So anybody ever wants to be dealing with the, these kind of products, they can reach out to us. Uh, and I think that's about it. Uh, it's 5.7 million uh, users across the world now, which, of which about 3 million were uh, during the last two years, the downloads. And thank you. Thanks a lot.